Now, the governing New Patriotic Party has congratulated the opposition in D.C. on the selection of Professor Jane Nano Pukwajemang as running mate for former President John Mahama in the December election. Addressing a news conference at Accra, Director of Communications for the MPP, Jane Ya Wabing Asama, said, Though the choice of a woman should ideally be hailed, Professor Poku Ajemang has failed to prove she has a track record of fighting for women and their welfare, adding her abysmal performance in the education sector makes her a no match for Vice President Dr. Mama Dubamia. In an ideal world, one of the strongest things going for the selection of the good professor would have been that she is a woman, and this would be met with a lot of enthusiasm. Unfortunately, Professor Upukwaj might hardly meet the expectations of someone who has a track record of fighting for women or their welfare. Luckily for all of us, Jaina Upukwaj is not new to Ghana politics, and it's her performance during her period as a political appointee that we are going to continue referring to from now on in. We need not remind anybody that it was during her tenure that training teachers' allowances were scraped. It was done without paying any heed to the many appeals to reconsider the decision. Indeed, it was one of the things she was proud to have done, scraping teacher allowances. Solidly on her front desk, the cold-hearted manner in which teachers were treated cannot easily be forgotten, either by the teachers themselves or the nation. Let it not again be forgotten that Professor Nana Upokwajima had been a teacher herself before she came to the position of Minister of Education. And yet, it was during her period that classroom teachers were denied common chalk to be able to write on blackboards. And we all remember the infamous saying, we didn't give you chalk today, 